Welcome Libras. I'm back guys with another video for y'all. We're going to take a look into September and see what we got going for the month of September, right? So let's see what we got guys for September. I didn't pre-shuffle, so give me a second to shuffle up and see what's going on. Let's see what we got. If you are new to the channel, welcome guys. I'm happy to have you here. Go ahead and click the subscribe button and click that bell to, for the notification squad, okay? So you can get those notifications so you won't miss out on any future videos, okay? So this is for the sun, moon, rising, and Venus sign of Libra, okay? So let's see what we got. Oh, everything that you need, guys, is in, going to be in the description box below. If you would like to order the Money Magnet oil, guys, is out. This oil has been selling out. I'm coming up. I'm actually um, getting ready to do a new batch. It's already actually done. I'm getting ready to do some shipping out. So if you guys would like to order, guys, you can click the um, check the description box, click the link to my Etsy shop, and you can shop there. If you would like to purchase the merchandise, check on the um, right below this video. I have a merchandise shelf where you can look at the shirts that I have to offer. I also have a few face masks as well as fanny packs as well. All right. And if you want to book your own personal reading, guys, that information, all that, everything that you need is going to be in the description box below. All right. So I'm here to shuffle up three more times for Libra. And then we're going to go. Three. All right. So at the bottom of the deck, I got the Knight of Pentacles, Virgo, Taurus, Capricorn, definitely Capricorn's energy and the Two of Swords. And the eight of cups so you're not sure why somebody uh you're not sure if you want to walk away from someone or you're not sure what took so long for someone to leave um but i feel like you were getting kind of tired or something okay two of cups and the king of cups yeah there's a relationship here and we got the strength card here uh leo's energy but someone keeps talking or there's a conversation here. I see a conversation here. Okay. So let's see what we got. Libra. All right. So I got the five of pentacles, the death card, the ten of cups, the moon, the seven of swords, and the king of pentacles. All right, and the King of Swords, yikes, the Queen of Wands, the Queen of Swords, and the Six of Cups. Okay, what do we have here? Libras, okay. So right now, some of you guys could be feeling rejected or left out in the cold. Somebody got cut off for sure. With the King of Swords and the Five of Pentacles, somebody feels abandoned or left out in the cold. Um, with the Ten of Cups here, somebody could have walked away from a relationship and ended it here with the Death card. The Moon card is here, so there could have been some secrets, especially here with the Seven of Swords here as well. Like, I'm getting like, there's been some sneaky, sneaky stuff going on, okay? We got the King of Pentacles, Virgo, Taurus, Capricorn, Male, King of Swords, Libra, Gemini, Aquarius, Queen of Swords, Libra, Gemini, Aquarius. So, King of Swords and Queen of Swords is here. Let's dive into this. Why is the Five of Pentacles here? Yes, something is over with. The Ten of Swords and the world. Something is over with. And when I tell you this thing came down hard, we got the Tower card. Okay, so something happened just like out of the blue. All of a sudden, it just abruptly ended. 11, 11. This just did the same thing in my previous video. It was 10, 10. And it's 11, 11 p.m. right now while, I'm, while I am. Okay. So some of you guys may have been asking for signs. Um, spirit has been speaking to you. And I hope you guys have been listening to your intuition. Why is the death card here? There's definitely been an ending. I don't feel like you're too happy about this. With the death card and the sun card, there could be a Leo involved or a Scorpio. But I don't see you being very happy about this at all. Why is the sun card here? The, the three of wands. Why 
or maybe it's that you didn't see it coming. I think that's more so what it is. You didn't see this coming. Um, I feel like there's there was a lot of spitefulness, a lot of disagreements, like a lot of arguments in the situation, but you just didn't see this coming. Why is the Ten of Cups here? The Ten of Cups and the Seven of Cups. Somebody could have their options open. Um, yeah, somebody's looking for something better and they're deciding to move on. Um, this could be your energy or a partner's energy. This does not necessarily have to be love. It could be career and finances. It could just be someone that is around you, okay? So take what resonates and leave and leave the rest. But I'm definitely getting like somebody is definitely deciding to move on, okay? Um, why is the moon here? Why is the moon card here? Why is the moon card here? Eight of Cups. Yeah, somebody secretly, you secretly walked away from someone or you've been hiding your feelings, okay? You've been hiding your feelings of you wanting to leave. Um, now I got the King of Wands here, Leo, Sagittarius, Aries. Um, you may, this person that you're dealing with could be really, really handsome, um, but I feel like you guys walked out on somebody or like I'm getting just getting like you feel bad for walking out on someone or just some somebody walked out on somebody. Okay. And I'm definitely getting that. Why is the eight of cups here? The temperance card. You somebody left for their own peace. Somebody won somebody left peacefully or tried to leave peacefully. Seven of Swords. In the past energy, this person, you could have been, oh, somebody was playing mind games. Somebody was playing with somebody's mind. The magician and the seven of swords. Yeah. But I feel like, okay, we got the justice, the eight of pentacles, and the eight of wands. Lots of eights here. Um, but with the justice card, this is you guys' energy. Um, you could be dealing with, I feel like for some of you, this may not be you, but this could be somebody around you. Because I'm getting like somebody either tried to tell you that this person was playing mind games or vice versa. Like I'm getting like somebody tried to tell somebody that somebody was playing mind games with them. The magician and the seven of swords is definitely somebody using manipulation, um, trickery, uh, just things in that nature, like playing mind games. I'm getting very much so like a narcissist person. Okay, so we got the King of Pentacles moving ahead, future energy. Why is the King of Pentacles here? The Two of Cups. Okay, so this is a connection, a relationship, a bond. Why is the Two of Cups here? This is wanting to be with this person. And I got the Star card, okay? Aquarius is energy. But I feel like you want to be, if this is the King of Pentacles, Virgo, Taurus, Capricorn that you're dealing with, I feel like you hope that, you know, there's a un a reunion because I do see the outcome being the Six of Cups. That is like a coming back together, a rekindling on you know, thoughts of memories of the past. But I do feel like you hope that this union comes back together. Why is the star card here? Eight of Swords and the Hierophant. Somebody is afraid of commitment. Okay. I'm just going to put that out there. Somebody is afraid to settle down. Somebody is afraid of a commitment. Somebody is afraid to take things to the next level. Okay. So why is the King of Swords here? You're very, uh, yeah, you're, ooh, Three of Swords. Three of Swords and a King of Swords. Somebody cut somebody with a knife through the heart. Okay. Somebody was juggling here. But you might have been waiting for this person to make a decision, okay? You might have been waiting for this person to make, make up their mind, okay? Or you were just waiting to make up your mind. But I feel like this person could have possibly even put some, put you in a third-party situation. Knight of Swords, yeah. You are pissed. And I'm getting three of cups, three of pentacles, and the king of wands. There could have definitely been a third-party situation going on here. Um, and somebody is, you may feel like this person is reckless, and you may feel like, like, damn, like you had to do it like that. You may feel like this was just ruthless. Queen of Wands. Why is the Queen of Wands here? Five of Cups. So somebody over here is feeling bad because they're single. So, yeah, somebody wants, this other person wants you to regret this decision. Okay. 
So you decided to walk away. They want you to regret the decision. Okay. Ooh. Yes. Because whatever, whoever you're dealing with, this person is fine as hell. King of Wands, Queen of Wands, King of Swords, Queen of Swords. Like you may feel like this person was your match. But um, this person that you're dealing with is very handsome or very fine. And they are just like all of that to you. Yeah, Knight of Cups. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Ace of Wands. Ten of Pentacles. Mm-hmm. This person wanted to start a family with you. They wanted something long-term with you. Somebody here is asking for sex as well. Why is the Queen of Swords here? Page of Wands. Lots of communication. Like, you want to talk to this person. Something like, I'm getting like somebody tried to tell somebody or tried to warn somebody, but somebody didn't want to listen. And somebody couldn't make up their mind. There was somebody here was torn between two people. Okay, because I got the Lovers and the Two of Swords. Page of Wands. Why is the Page of Wands here? High Priestess. Your intuition is tell was telling you that you needed to have a conversation with this person. A real, truthful, honest conversation with this person. Because like I said, we got the lovers here. This is a decision between two people. Okay? And the Justice card. So, there's definitely like trying to find balance. The Justice card is you guys' energy as well. But I'm getting like someone tired of being nice or tired of telling somebody um, something here. And then we got the Six of Cups as the outcome. This is memories of the past, okay? We got the strength card and the knight of pentacles. Leo energy and Capricorn. Yeah, I'm getting Capricorn energy with the devil card here. Um, but I feel like you may feel like I'm getting this. Uh, someone's mother could be involved with the empress here and the nine of wands. I'm getting like, listen to your mother, listen to your aunt, listen to... I'm getting like, um, listen to... Whoever this empress person is and stay single with the nine of pentacles because I'm getting like, I told you that it wasn't going to work or I knew that it wasn't going to work. Why is the devil card here? The queen of cups. Okay, I'm getting a lot of people here. I got the strength card, Leo's energy, knight of pentacles, Capricorn, devil, Capricorn, queen of cups, Pisces, Cancer, Scorpio. And the four of wands. Someone here could you could be dealing with family, or someone here could most definitely be living with you. There's a living arrangement, or there's a marriage here. Um, but I'm getting like listen to your mama. I'm getting that, and I know that's not the case for everyone. But I got the empress here, the nine of wands, and the nine of pentacles. Why is the four of wands here? King of Cups. I'm getting someone's husband. But look at this. This is what's so weird about this reading. Is that we got the Queen of Swords, King of Swords. We got the um, King of Wands, Queen of Wands. We got the King of Cups, Queen of Cups. So, I'm getting that there's a match here. Like, something to that nature. Yeah, see the lovers here. Um, I'm getting like someone loves somebody here. Um... But someone decided to choose, make a decision, and somebody feels like they have to move on. Yeah, see, Nine of Pentacles. I'm getting self-love, too, as well. Like, you guys may be working on self-love. And you you guys are just decided to be single because you love yourself more than you love, you know. You want to pour more into yourself than pouring into them, okay? I'm getting that somebody's jealous, too, with the Five of Swords. So this this ended abruptly. Somebody was trying to play mind games, but this person wants to make you re want you to regret the decision that you made. So I'm getting like you guys made the decision to walk away from a situation that was no longer serving you anyway. It wasn't serving you no way. Okay, so let's get the kippers out. Let's see what the kippers have to say. Okay, so this is going to be, uh, what do they want to say to you? What do they want to say? How do they view you? How do they feel about you? How do they feel about Libra? What do they want to say? All right, so we have toil and labor. All right, and then we have a marriage here. 
Like I said, I feel like somebody could possibly be married in a situation or wanting to work on a marriage with the toil and labor. That's like the eight of pentacles to me in a marriage. Here. So somebody could be deciding that they want to uh, work on uh, their home life. We got message of concern. So there could have been some type of message of concern that concerned you. Okay. So let's see. We got sudden wealth. All right, and the mature man. Okay, so there's a possible... Ooh, somebody's giving somebody gifts. Somebody's been giving somebody gifts. I got gifts and mature man and um, sudden well. Somebody's been giving somebody money, okay? So I'm getting that. Like, this is what they want to say to you or how they view you. Somebody's been giving somebody gifts and money, okay? I'm just saying... All right, so we got bad health and expectations. So somebody's expecting something that somebody can't give, okay? Because we got despair here. And that's kind of like the five of pentacles energy to me, which is kind of like being left out in the cold or not being able to fit in or, you know, just money not looking too good. So I'm getting, from what I'm getting here, I'm getting like somebody was giving somebody gifts and stuff or helping somebody out. Okay, and somebody is expecting that to continue. Okay, so let's let me grab some clarifiers. Cause I want to be nosy. Let's see. Libra, please clarify these messages for my Libra. Why is toil and labor here? Well, well, God, that jumped right on out. Ten of Cups. Queen of Cups. Oh, so I got Ten of Cups and, and Queen of Cups. That's someone who's very emotionally satisfied. Okay, so some somebody wasn't going to be satisfied until they, until they walked away. Okay? It doesn't matter. Somebody feels like they put in a, they put in an effort or somebody here is putting in effort. Um, and they somebody is satisfied being that they walked away. So I'm just getting that. Somebody had a hidden agenda, too. The moon and the ten of pentacles. Like, I'm getting, like, a hidden agenda. Why is sudden wealth here? Hermit. You could be dealing with a Virgo. And the Empress. Okay, so I'm definitely getting, like, mother energy or an aunt, grandmother. Somebody is waiting till later. Wait until later. To see if this is going to work or how something's going to work out. But somebody's backing off from giving or helping someone. I'm getting that too. I'm turning here. The emperor. Okay. Somebody's father could be involved or an older man. Okay. But I'm getting like somebody's distancing themselves um, from being giving. I'm getting that as well. Yeah. And to, to something get resolved. Okay, so I got the five of wands and the justice card. So somebody's ghosting somebody or backing off until somebody get fixed their issue, some type of issue that they have. Okay, because I'm getting that there could possibly be a mystery woman here with the high priestess and the queen of wands. Um, I'm getting Pisces and Leo, Sagittarius, Aries. Okay, I'm getting like somebody real deal is talking shit. Page of wands and, well, I'm sorry, page of pentacles and the five of swords. Or someone called somebody crying or upset, okay? Somebody's crying because they're single um, and have to possibly be independent and fend for themselves. When they feel like, I'm getting like someone here is dealing, have, dealing with someone who's married. I want to say that because I got the lovers, the king of cups, and the four of wands. I'm seeing that as well. Could be dealing with the Aries. But I'm definitely getting like an older male could be involved. Cause the hermit is kind of like an older energy and the emperor is definitely older energy. I'm getting like someone could possibly be wealthy um, and a little older, you know, and, and more stable and settled in financially. Then we got bad health. Why is bad health here? The eight of cups. So somebody could have this. Somebody walked away because this was not affecting them well. Like. 
this person could have had anxiety. This, this situation could have been bringing uh, this person anxiety or bringing you some type of anxiety. But I'm getting lots of confusion. I'm telling you that right now. Seven of Cups and the Knight of Swords. Like, this was just crazy energy. Somebody thinks that somebody is crazy. I'll tell you that. And somebody most definitely decided, is like, this is crazy. This is too much for me. I got to go. Six of Swords and the World. Okay? And they left. And somebody left for their own peace. Telling you that right now. All right. So, what is expectation here? Five of Swords. Somebody expects for somebody to put up the fight and fight this all the way through. Tell Somebody's telling all their business. I'm getting that as well. Why is the Five of Swords here? The Tower. Yeah. Somebody expects for somebody to fight this through and argue and nitpick with them. Nah. Mm -mm, I'm out. <laughs> Why is the Tower card here? Why is the Tower card here? This one to come out. There's been a shocking truth that is getting ready to be revealed or has already been revealed, okay? But somebody has cut off a source of resource or income with the death card and the ten of pentacles. Somebody could also be contemplating or talking about a divorce as well. Why is the ace of swords here? I'm getting somebody. They told me they was divorced. I'm getting that as well. Like, I'm hearing that. Why is the Queen of Swords and the... Okay, we got the Queen of Swords and the Strength card. All right? And I'm telling you, this situation is causing a lot of anxiety. Okay? Talking about this man. Somebody is, like, full, real deal in love with somebody. Knight of Cups. Lovers. Leo energy is definitely involved. I saw that a few times. But I feel like... Somebody just got tired of all the confusion and just decided to be, what, single. All right. So, let's see what the angels have to say. Let's see what the angels got to say. And then I'm going to let y'all roll. All right. So, what message is there for my Libra? Thank you. What message is there? Thank you. Give me another message for my Libras. Thank you. All right. So we got you're ready. We got, um, then we got wait. Then we got there's something better. So maybe there's something that you thought you was ready for, but you may really wasn't. Um, there's something better coming. And then we got helpful people. But there's something that you need to get more information about. There's something that you possibly want more information about or you're getting ready to get more information about it. Why is helpful people here? Why is helpful people here? The Empress, like I said, that keeps coming out. Why is the Empress here? Could be different, but this is you guys' energy as well, too. I forgot about that. This is you guys' energy as well as Taurus energy. So you could be dealing with another Libra or a Taurus. But I'm getting like, no, some of y'all are getting advice. The angels want you to get advice from an older woman or a woman that's of grace and can give you some some great advice. Okay? I'm getting that. And I feel like this advice is going to be helpful for you to help you move forward. Okay? Um, I'm seeing that as well. I'm seeing it. Like, I'm getting, like, you're getting advice from um, an aunt, um, someone just older that you trust, someone that's very, um, you know, you feel like you could tell this person anything. Spirit is saying get, get advice from someone that you trust. We got you're ready. <laughs> yeah, see, we got the Three of Wands and the Seven of Cups. Okay, so rated right on Mr. Right is what I'm getting here with the King of Cups. Okay, so you're deciding that when you're ready, you'll, you know, you'll take that action that you need to take. But right now, I feel like some of y'all are trying to open up your options. Okay. Um, somebody's saying that they didn't tell me that they were married. I'm hearing that. Like someone, I'm, I keep hearing it. Okay, and I got the emperor here. Wait for your man, okay? The emperor or the empress. The emperor and the empress keeps coming out together, okay? And I feel like you're waiting for someone that's more mature, someone who, you know, has 
who can give you more stability someone who isn't as you know childlike behavior i feel like you're deciding that you're going to wait i'm getting like waiting for mr right is what i'm getting as well because i feel like you feel like this situation was very petty and like very just kind of like needs to be resolved or balanced out for some of you this is a father okay i'm getting mother and father i'm getting that as well too why is the emperor here two of pentacles and three of cups yeah there could be a multitude of somebody has is juggling here some type of shocking truth came out there's something better. The shock of truth came out and you were surprised because you thought you you thought that things were making progress and then boom. I got the page of swords, okay? So be on the lookout, okay? Because something better is on the horizon for you. Watch the page of swords here. Three of Pentacles. You can find your find someone at work. Okay. You may have people looking at you at the job. Yeah, the star card, Aquarius. Like, you may find someone at the job, but you're hoping that this person regrets what they did or how, whatever happened between you and this person, you're hoping that they regret it, okay? Money could be involved with the Ace of Pentacles here. Yeah, money is involved. Ace of Pentacles and the Ten of Pentacles. Um, and I got the Two of Swords and the Hierophant. Like I said, someone didn't tell you that they would live with someone or they were married or they had something else going on. But you're hoping that they regret it. Um, I'm getting that money was involved. I'm getting that as well. Yeah. Somebody's hiding their feelings. Someone's hot in their feelings. Okay, so that's going to be the message that I have for my Libras. I hope this message was helpful for you guys. And I will chat with y'all on the next go-round, all right? Ciao.